what's cracking? Is the hammered airsoft smith man? I know I haven't really put up anything uh, airsoft in quite a while, but uh. Oh, it's gonna happen soon, dude. It's gonna happen fucking soon, dude. Look, 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 look. Dude. Wait, 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 wait. Dude. Or how about this? Bruh. Bruh. There you go. Yeah. Anyways. So, uh. Gonna have some shit up sometime, man. Pretty soon. Some new airsoft content coming at you from the hammered airsoft smith. Fucking final fucking Lee, huh, dude? Yeah. Um. So I found a submarine. I found a lot of the shit. And that's one of the things I love most about this game, is how every time you turn it on, you find something. Like, I don't know what happens to you, or me. It's like every fucking time, dude, there was a fucking submarine by my island, dude. Yeah. And it was the Chinese, okay? And, uh, if you don't play the game and you got offended by what I just said, then... That's on you, buddy. You need to educate yourself in the Fallout world, because... That's what happened, man. The Chinese came to the U.S. It was a short war with fucking centuries of an outcome. God damn. <sighs> um, yep, Chinese submarine. I don't know if they were spying on me. You know, I know I sound paranoid, but I mean, come on, we're in a, we're, the game takes place in America, and they are the Chinese. So, I mean, and you know how, like, these Fallout games are. You make yourself a big name, and some of the biggest names, like Caesar, House, you know, uh, the fucking president, dude, like... Those kind of people reach out for you, so I wouldn't be surprised if fucking the Chinese sent some shit after me. But I don't think that was the case because when I got there, um, as soon as I went in there, and this is how fucking patriotic I was. I'm in there with my lever action gun from the 1800s, right? And I see a Chinese officer just walking around, but he was like ghoulified, and he didn't seem like he was feral. It's gonna sound really bad, but I think some of you won't even blame me. Um, so I, I fucking busted a fucking cap right in his fucking side of his head, dude. Not even like I didn't think twice about it. I just popped once and he was, it was a fucking rat for him, dude. And uh, I'd say his homies would be pouring out some liquor for him, but they're all fucking dead too, so. The whole rest of the submarine was um, feral ghouls. I seem to be fighting them a lot lately. I don't know what that's about. Maybe that's just a coincidence because of Halloween and all that. Um, well, shit, my life's Halloween all year round. Fucking tricking trees all over the fucking place. So, um, yeah, a lot of ghouls lately. So, with that said, I know I'm doing a lot of talking and not a lot of showing. Ooh, I'm about to talk about that in a minute. But, uh... Fucking submarine... Outfit... And the hat. And I know it's, like, kind of like... Okay, well... Some people look at it this way now. I think a lot of military personnel... Think this way, too. If you're... you're an American in America, and a communist, you know, you're wearing a communist uniform, I mean, that's a, like a little, uh, uh, it's not a good look, you know what I'm saying, but it is on her, it's your girl Sujin, 
Yeah, boy. I don't know if I ever said, but, uh, Sujin. Oh, I never went over the origins of Sujin. If you guys follow my, uh, channel a lot, you guys would be so familiar with the name Sujin. But, I'll go over that another time. But, uh, she's looking good. I gotta stay on topic. That's my thing. I, I have a hard time focusing. Um, the fuck was I doing? I think I was gonna go home. Working on, like, a little side project in the game. I got hobbies within a hobby. But anyways, man, I like the, the, the Chinese outfit. It's fucking cool. You know, kind of go. You know, has a, goes with my the rest of my getup when I'm not wearing vault uniforms and whatnot. So, uh, and it's weird. The submarine doesn't even show up on the map. So, uh, anyway, yeah, that was done. There was no nothing too big of a deal that I found in there. It seemed like the kind of place where a bobblehead a bobblehead would be, but I, I already have them all. So, damn <laughs> pimp. And, uh, but the last couple of days, I was trying to get the road goggles, and, um, they're, they're dubbed on forums around the internet, like IGN and whatever, as the, uh, Unicorn of Fallout 4. Those are the goggles she's wearing here. Um, I can just have it so you can see the goggles. I love these. Some people think they're funny looking. I love them. And the main attraction to them isn't so much, I don't think it's so much because they're rare. Um, that's kind of why I was attracted to them. Other than their looks. But it gives you plus one intelligence. So that's pretty fucking cool. I don't know how goggles give you plus one intelligence, but... Then again, I haven't questioned much of anything else other than the weapons in this game, so, <laughs> guess I can't say anything now. And, um, they're apparently at the Charles Anima Theater, theater with the Pillar Cultist people. I'm so bad at this shit. Look at this. I'm a mess. Okay. So... here there's cultists there and uh, they're not really important <laughs> they're kind of expendable like me so <laughs> you go there and they randomly spawn with different gear and one of the, their things is the road goggles and uh, you're a lucky motherfucker apparently if you just stumble upon them some people sit on forums like, oh my god, I had them, and I thought they were just so, I thought they were like going to be a common thing, because all the other guy wasn't a solo more, they fucking lost them. But, they're really fucking rare, and, um, places res respawn in seven days, but when you play on survival, things respawn like every 90 days or some crazy shit like that, so, I was like, yeah, I'm not going to find that anytime soon with these fucking people. So, um, and then I found out in Far Harbor, there's a, there's a, a specific spot where you can get them, where they always spawn there, and it's, uh, in the Vault 118, I believe, and it's under the, um, Cliff Edge Hotel. I don't want to spoil too much for you, because it's actually pretty interesting down there, and, um, Make it sound like you're walking into Amsterdam or something. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Um, yeah, I went down there. I got a I got a Volt jumpsuit. I like to collect those. I like the way they look. Um, and I just like to collect things. I'm weird like that. I'm having a hard time focusing. Oh, shit. And the goggles are down there. There. Whew. 
I had to say it, make sure I said it aloud while it popped up in my head. Yeah, the rogue goggles are down there, guaranteed. Um, you don't have to steal them or anything like that, so you just walk up in the bitch and just take them. They're in the museum section of the book. That's all I'm really going to say about it because I don't want to spoil them. But anyway. Um, so I just fucking went and did that. Then I lost dog meat for a while. I was like, yo, where is he? It turned out he was still in Far Harbor. What an asshole. Um, right now, the current moment, I was on my way to uh, back home so I can upgrade a few guns or whatever for one of my merchants, my medic, at the clinic over in uh, the castle town or whatever. He, um,. I don't know, man. I feel like the medics should definitely have a, a little more protection than infantry. Only, not saying that they're more important, but only because, you know, not everyone is a medic. So, it's like, and there's not like hundreds and hundreds of medics everywhere. So, it's like when it comes to, be, like, combat or whatever, I try to think to, okay, well, if I only have one medic, which I do, I only have one, unless you want to count the surgeon as a medic. Um, just want to make sure they're well equipped, man, so that way they can live and be able to, uh, serve longer. And why the fuck is the BAR a 45 at standard? BAR is actually a 30 odd 6. Is it? See, Fallout New Vegas is throwing me off now. You can get a BAR rechambered, rechambered in 308, but I think typically it's a, it's a 30 odd 6. Part of me feels a little unsure because a 30 odd 6 is a really hot round. Maybe it's a 30 30? It's like an American AK. It's like 308 as opposed to it's like 762. this fool out. Um. Yeah, I don't fucking understand that. Like. 45. I don't think there's ever been a 45 caliber. Um. B.A.R. Poach. What the fuck are you... Huh. So... That's what I'm doing, man. I'm pimping out my medic there. I could've just said that. Ooh, you fucking whore. Goddamn go whore gutter slut. You fucking... Hooch. <laughs> um... I was gonna get him ammo. Let me give him like a hundred rounds. This ammo is so common. So someone said to me the other day that I should do like a radio show. Imagine that. Imagine listening to me on the fucking radio. <laughs> I think that would be so weird. It's like, well, I'm going to turn on a radio station and has that fucking dickhead on there. Oh yeah, I know what you're talking about, yeah. <laughs> Put it on. Was there anything else? I wanted to drop off here. Where am I hearing? that music from in here
Damn, dude, that speaker is fucking booming, dude. That speaker is fucking pimp, dude. Shit. Ah, <sighs> fuck. So I'm kind of going around lately just collecting apparel. And, uh, oh, going back to the BAR, that's the other thing I was going to say. I was like, why the fuck is it 45 standard? And when you do have it in 308, which is a more reasonable caliber for it, or more true to the original caliber, or whatever, why is it not in full auto? The BAR was a full auto weapon. A machine gun. Some people might call it a light machine gun. A soul rifle. Fucking dumb. Sorry. That's dumb. John's being nuts that I can't trade with him. Yeah, look at him. He looks like a fucking pimp. So what's up, G unit? G unit. Sorry, I'm being retarded. Uh, Any news out there, Doctor? Nothing that would interest you. Now, let's talk about you and your health. Oh, fuck you! I hook a brother up, and is that how you fucking talk to me, bitch? Oh, baseball playing ass bitch. I have to fucking wait to give him his weapons and. Whatever, it's so fucking. I don't know, I should sleep the day away. Why not? <sighs> Pooch. The farm's not much. Oh my god, you people bitch too much, man. You take a look around you motherfuckers, the end of the world. Yes. I mean, not to sound cocky, but I'm the best you got. I hook you up. I give you fucking free armor, free everything. You fucking live here for fucking free. I don't have a goddamn dime for nobody. This bitch eating noodles. That's cool, though. What's up, Where's my vault dweller homegirl? I'm not gonna lie, man. She, I think she's like the finest character I've seen in the game other than mine, of course. My character is the finest. Where? I, and that chick Anne, she's nuts because I won't see her. But she'll just be talking. It's like she's hiding in the fucking food. I think he is up here. There he is. Let's trade. Hooking you up, man. Don't be a fucking whore. Yeah, he's gonna fuck shit up. Ever since I put up walls, though, wow, this is gonna sound very Trump. Put up a few walls and it seems like the castle never is under siege. Something else I was gonna give him. Ammo. Ammo for this is so common lately. I'll give him I'll give him fifty. Yeah, I really hooked you up, dude. Better fucking Look my fucking toes, dude. Where is she? There she is, getting jacked. No one ever talks about her either. She's so underrated. Like, she fine as hell. Look at this. Not really. All right. Be around. Yeah, you better be.
Holy fuck. It's a good fucking coffee. God damn. My fucking Walter PPK, my fucking Marlin 1895, my fucking Smith and Wesson Model 29. What the fuck are we gonna do now, Pooch? I'm gonna put my helmet on first so I don't get a fucking cold. She looks pimp. I don't give a fuck what anyone says. I have a hard time sticking to clothing. I think without intentionally you know, or thinking about it. I think my favorite outfit or whatever in this game has got to be like the Volt jumpsuits with the leather. It just reminds me so much of like Fallout 3 and New Vegas with their Volt armor. I just like the look, it just looks so unique, it's not, you don't see that in other games, you know what I mean, like, that's just like, the, the thing that sets Fallout from the others, you know what I mean, like, it's like, people recognize that jumpsuit, and they're just like, oh yeah, you know, fucking Fallout, you know, but I also like the, um, the black BOS, armor with the combat armor over it and uh Kellogg's outfit's pretty cool for a fucking asshole piece of shit fucking ass clown Um, the, the marine wetsuit. I love that one. Can't tell. The synth uniform is pretty cool. Um, but I think it's the Volt one. It seems like that's the one I go to the most. The metal armor is cool. It reminds me of like a night suit. Alright, I have no idea what I'm doing in here. Fucking so retarded. Scorpion would taste like. The lighting in here is fucking pimp. I kind of want to put a light here. Uh, I don't even bother picking up my fucking phone anymore. My typewriter, I have to scrap it. Fuck it. Was there a fucking cat there? Probably. Oh, you know what? I think she's tripping over the fucking sledgehammer that's been here since the beginning. Oh well. I like the fact that I found out recently because of, uh... I don't know how I didn't know this, but when I found out this was beer, I was like, oh shit, from Far Harbor, I was like, oh. It was the first time my characters ever had a drink. It was in Far Harbor. I had a Vim. The corset's pretty cool, too.
Oh, I think I was gonna... I'm probably never gonna use that, though. Explosive rounds is just so funny to me, unless it's like... A shotgun. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm so retarded. <laughs> I kind of want to see what that's like, though. I don't think I've ever used explosive rounds. Going back to sleep. It's going to be so... Oh. Give me a shitty ass video. Fucking get this the fuck out of there. I don't fucking want it, you whore. Happy fucking Halloween. I don't think I rebated these. Yeah, definitely not the bear one. The, the thing with the fucking bears, dude, that's crazy. That I, in my experience, anyways. Okay, so I could set up a trap for the rad stags, and other rad stags don't give a fuck. They bail. They're like, no, he's trapped. We can't do anything. And then that's it. There's they just give up. Death claws, it's like, okay, you trap a death claw, and over time, it's like, maybe one other death claw might show up. Maybe. To try and get his homeboy back. But the fucking Yag, why? It seems like every time there's one trapped in here. There's one over here, usually, and there's one way over here somewhere fucking hiding. And the one that's usually way over here is like one of the higher leveled ones, like one of the most badass ones, like the shaggy ones or whatever, and the rabid ones. fucking crazy and I always forget to check because I'm still not used to it before I open the cage and I end up fighting fucking two bears at once and that shit ain't no joke Pooches, Pooches freaks out Pooch is like I can only do so much I'm trying to fuck him up and it's just he's fat and pissed I don't even know if I have enough time, but I kind of want to travel to Red Rocket, or uh, Sanctuary Hills, actually.
Ah, that's shady. Fuck you gonna do about it? How do I? Oh. Give me those, because I want to try this thing out. Unless I put it away without realizing. I guess it actually has to hit a target. It's one of those things. Oh! Oh my god! Oh, they're fighting! Look out! An albino! Look at these fucking clowns! Yeah, fucking sip my coffee, dude. Look at Kermit with the fro with the tea. I guess they don't hurt each other too much. Cause oh, wait a minute. Oh, that one's gonna fucking die soon. He's running. He's running. Get him. Getting shot, huh? I noticed that none of these enemies like getting shot. You're dead, dude. Die. You're fucking next. Oh, you went pissed off the fucking pooch. Oh, you done fucked up now. <laughs> Damn. Damn, man. Fucking crazy fucking game, dude. Oh my, look at that. Oh my god, that's fucking crazy. I did that, dude. 
I'm going way off track for this fucking death call. I normally don't go over here. I'm taking a little bit of a detour. I want to retrieve my game, dude. Oh my god, I don't even have the bloody mess perk or anything either. Look at this. I don't even think that exists in this game. Uh, yeah, it does. Oh, that reminds me. Yeah, isn't it like... What wasn't it? Wasn't it? Wasn't it there, dude? Wasn't it fucking there, dude? I don't even fucking know. I thought it was in the game, dude. Isn't it? Yeah, see? See that? I'm not fucking lying. I have none of them. My luck isn't even all that fucking serious, dude. Gotta get that sneak up, you know what I'm saying? Look, he looks like a little fucking rapist. He's like, oh, I'm gonna get the fucking titties and ass. <laughs> Why does it sound like Mario? He's like teabagging the fuck out of that barrel. Oh. Holy shit, okay. I made it here anyway, dude. What the f- Oh, yeah. <sighs> Dumbass. Yeah, I'm really bad at this, man. I keep forgetting to put my timer on. See what I have time for, but no. Keep forgetting. I'm going the wrong fucking way. Ugh. Ugh, fuck, excuse me. Come on, pooch, move your ass. You're gonna cut me off, fucking move. Shut the fuck up about the institute. God damn. Fucking asshole. Get off the road, you dick. Where the fuck are you going, slut? Oh, you wanna fight? Oh, you wanna fucking fight? You cut me off, motherfucker. I don't care if you are driving a fucking Ferrari. Fuck out of here. Fucking Brotherhood of Steel have been fucking up my ass lately. They're trying real hard to get me out of the friend zone. What the hell? What the fuck? Oh, 
Oh my god, that scared the fuck out of me, because I actually hurt him a little bit. Ooh. Look at that. Oh my god, are you serious? That was so fucking cool. That was like tremors. When they fucking had the dynamite and the fucking tremor blew the fuck up and all its brains and fucking guts were everywhere. It was so fucking awesome. Hey, you wanna roll, dude? You wanna go toe to toe, dude? This punk? Whoa. Oh. Yeah. It's kind of. Whoa. Yeah. I think I'm kind of a pimp with this fucking gun. <laughs> and as I say that, <laughs> I knew it was gonna fucking happen, dude. It never fails. That was cool as fuck, though. Like, I don't know if that looked as cool to you guys as it did to me, but why am I going that way? I gotta go. Oh, so tempting to hunt. No, I didn't mean to do that. I do that so much. Oh, it's a good thing I got a lot of them. Huh. Move your ass. Pooch. He drives like a fucking lake wind driver. I'll be honest, I heard a weird noise, so now I'm just kind of running in just a generalized oh, okay, good <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, dude the game fucking scares me sometimes there's some asshole over here and uh, the, the corpse there, I don't know if you, know, you did the little quest there or whatever the mission there um if you end up killing the one guy his his body body wow his body stays there and the stuff always responds on him not like it's a huge deal I mean it's only like low level bullshit but money's money Come on, you fucking jump every other fucking time. I'm almost there. I'm gonna tell you fucking throw it. I'm gonna do a fucking thing, bitch. Try to fuck on me. 
my fucking pooch. I gotta be honest, even though this is my first house I made in the game, I, uh, I don't really miss it, but it's definitely always pretty cool to come across it and look at it. It's like, damn, dude, I fucking built that shit way back. I just love the island, man. I don't know if it's a good or a bad thing that I can get from Spectacle Island to Sanctuary Hills in less than an hour. what I came here for. <laughs> what a loser, right? All that for that, because like I said, I've been on this kick lately where I've been collecting. See, if like, something like this was in Fallout 3 or Fallout New Vegas, I wouldn't want anything to do with it. Uh... bulky on her, that's what my fucking problem is. Eh, I'll take it anyway, collectors. Fuck you. Alright man, I think I'm gonna call it quits. I have no idea how long it's been on for and starting to lose focus a lot again and I don't wanna stray too much. Whew. 